Good day everybody, this is Nelka again and another question from our friend in Facebook again. And his name is Erfalak and he's asking about... Okay, I want to become a lighting designer and start working on my projects. And he's watching YouTube. And he said, I only have basic luminaire, the default, and only basic object in the furniture and object section. How can I find chairs and different and different variety of luminaires? Please help. Okay. So he's trying to download also the Torn plugin. All right. So, uh, Erfalak, it's very easy. If you want to find another object uh, and you don't like those default from Dialux itself, then uh, yeah I will teach you how to find the amazing chairs and other objects and for the luminaires yes I can tell you three different ways on how to find best luminaires in different brands okay so if you're not subscribed yet please subscribe now so you will not miss any amazing tutorials like this again okay so let's answer now Mr. Erfalak's question First, uh, let's start with the um, luminaires because I already opened some of my Dialux Evo. So the first one, I told you I can teach you different ways on how to get the luminaires or the IS files, not just torn, okay? So the first step is to go and check this one. There's a tab here at the end of your vertical tabs in Dialux Evo, which mentions manufacturer. Click that one and then you will find a lot of manufacturers list where you can select a lot of different types of fitting if you are not familiar with them then better mm. okay i will teach you how to find a best luminaire if you know the brands but if you for example know already the brand then you can get it from here for example if you know Desano then go and select this one click this click this one because there are so many brands here available there is vega okay my internet connection is really slow right now and then the other one is artimide for example and yeah there are so many things here below you can find lots of brands manufacturers suppliers of fittings or luminaires okay so just click this one if you are finding if you find it difficult to get the is file from this um brands then the other way is dun, 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 go and check the loom express search or type it in the google loom express and then from here you can select any fitting that you like for example, uh, what's this? Okay, sorry, it's not Loom Express, it's Loom Search. <laughs> Loom Search. Yeah, sorry. It's Loom Search. And here you go. The Loom Search is a part of the dialogues where you can find lots of fittings. Um, for example, you are working with industrial fitting, uh, industrial project. You can just type the keyword here and then it will give you the selections of different from the different brands. For example, I say you're working for the outdoor, just click this one, outdoor. And then you said you want to have a surface mounted, wall surface mounted. And if you can identify what kind of surface mounted you like, for example, is this the one you like, up and down, or just down, or like a glow of light over there. So, yeah, you can go and select from here, and then uh, select that one, for example. And then it will give you a lot of options. So most of the time, Loom Search will give you a bulkhead, because that is the one you selected. But if you are not sure if it's really bulkhead that you like, you can go and fill up these amazing uh, uh, keywords and uh, maybe you will find your uh, lovely fitting. So go and reset and then for example, the application is outdoor and then you will say the mounting mode is wall mounted for example and the adjustability is maybe tiltable 
Illuminate, if you're not familiar with this, just leave it. And then shape and dimensions, if you know, you say maybe it's round or square or rectangular compact or rectangular linear, for example. Light distribution, if you know, then do. If not, important is, do you know the IP rating? If you want IP65, because most of the time IP65 is for the outdoor, and you want the IK rating to be IK08, for example. If you're not familiar with this one, that is fine. Just leave it. And then, you can see here on the, your right side that uh, Loom Search will give you lots of options to choose from. And then, just go and check and select. This one doesn't fit to the requirements because it should be... Oh, okay. Maybe this is IP65. And then, yeah. And just keep scrolling and maybe you will find your amazing fitting that is suitable for your project. And if you really don't find it, go and search it by uh, name. Like, for example, uh, say, industrial fitting, for example. Industrial. Just try industrial. Maybe you're, for example, you're working with an industrial project. And then, yeah, so Loom Search will give you a lot of options. Iperated fitting, surface mounted, pendant, and etc. etc. So, this is the second way on how to select. Oh, of oh, course, I forgot how to use it. Of course, for example, you selected this one, this SLC Saudi lighting, for example. You selected it, and then once you selected it, you see there is one option here. Oh, it's not possible to send to dialogs. I don't know why it's like that. Let's see in the download. Oh, it's because it's in the zip file. But some of the luminaires, you can just press this one, send to dialogs, and then you can immediately use it. And let's try one more here. Maybe this, uh, yeah, this apple tone. Let's try this one. So this is, I think, a floodlight for industrial projects. See, this one is, yeah. Just click this one and it will go directly to your Dialogs software. Whatever is open, either Dialogs Evo or Dialogs Regular. Let's see, because I already opened my Dialogs Evo. Okay, see, now it's here. This Appleton floodlight is already here. And how about in my Dialogs Regular? Yes, it's already here. Perfect. So that's how you do it, uh, Air Falak. So don't worry. Uh, when you get used to it, you will love uh, shopping your perfect luminaire for your project the other option aside from looking it in the manufacturer's tab looking at the loom search it's time for you now to go to their website in and then study how you will extract the fitting or the IES file for example let's go to the regular dialogs in the loom Minera tab at the bottom there are options where you can just go and select for example the Bega. Click that one and it will go directly to their website. And then this is the time that you need to understand the website how you're going to extract the fitting. For example, the the, the products that you like is a bollard. And then just click the bollard, select one for example like this. And then you can either select from here, you want a 7.1 watt, just go and click this one. And then see the planning aids is here. Once you do that, once you click it, just go and press the ULD file or the ilum dot or the IS. But if you are working in Dialogs and Dialogs Evo, just select the ULD file. When you press this one, it goes transfer to Dialogs directly. If you press this one, it means you're downloading it. So, for example, I click this one. And then let's see. You say I will allow it. I'm using, it goes directly to my Internet Explorer, not um, Google Chrome. So, once it's done, see the Bega Bollard is now here in my active Luminaire thumbnail. And let's see if it's also working in the regular Dialogs. Yes, it's there. Perfect. Okay, so that's it. Um, Erfalak, that's how you do your uh, checking or shopping the perfect luminaire for your project. For your objects, because this uh, video is now getting long, I will set, uh, create a separate um, 
separate video tutorial on how to select um, objects from different ways um, or you maybe check some of my YouTube tutorials on how to uh, get 3ds file from different uh, website or links okay but I can create another video for you if you like so that's it um, if you want to know more for luck go and visit my website www.enrocolightingdesign.com and uh, of course YouTube channel please subscribe now so you will not miss any tutorials again the new one and then if you want to go further learn deeper about lighting design techniques go and enroll in one of my Udemy courses at www.udemy.com okay and of course I, you can still find me in my LinkedIn and Facebook page okay alright so see you again on the next video bye